Brush to 188822 Air 1, further 43 for your call. Apparently, the RP Brian's brother's GPS sent a ping with an unknown problem from the Round Canyon area. You're going to be looking for a white male, heavy set, brown shirt, black pants, brake. He was last seen driving an orange Chevy station wagon, and the subject is diabetic. Further information, he came in from the Ratton Pass side, but maybe closer to the Cassidy Trail side now. So they entered via Ratton Canyon, but might be closer to Cassidy Trail. Continuing westbound 68 now, coming into Harmony. Westbound 68 in Harmony. Driving the vehicle to be a cave in Chatterton. White male, orange tank top, blonde hair. This thing's a base, look at the lighting on it. Sorry, white male, you know, orange tank top. Let's check the CAD. So, brother GPS center ping, unknown problem, Ratton Canyon, white male, heavy set, brown shirt, black pants, orange Chevy station wagon. Hey, I've got the uh, vehicle that called out. There's a track that goes along here, so I'm going to take the brush truck up there, see if I can find them. I, I was just thinking that I would never find them, because I went down to the, uh, the Cassidy Trail down south, and yeah. then flipped back this way. Cool. Right, same thing. Yeah, so obviously located the uh, patient's vehicle, so I'm going to uh, take the brush truck up this track. It's like a truck and it, it goes into a V shape, so. Uh, 1031. Yep. Oh, I've uh, lost eyes. Anybody have eyes? Yeah, it goes onto like three branches up there. Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah. I'll go up there. I 
I got Dick. it here. Go westbound, westbound past 1031. It's gonna be over by a uh, semi truck here. Wearing an orange shirt, right? 10 more. Headed westbound 10 from 1031. Continuing westbound behind the ammunition. Westbound 1027 by the ammunition. Currently at 1021. Up in the fence here. Running uh, northbound towards the boat boathouse. Now northbound towards the boathouse, still on foot. Unit in the truck, he's right there to your right. To your right. Currently in front of the boathouse on Rena, 1021, continuing westbound. Westbound by the boathouse. Tasers drawn, old motel. Why a taser point? Counting, we're gonna be 1015, postal 1019, old motel. 11015 at 1019. Just showing this channel hold with the 23 way break. Brush four one eight 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 two two air one status. Brush four, we're in the area searching as reference notes on CADVs located the patient's vehicle on Rutten Pass, approximately half a mile west of Clafier Road. We're now out into uh, some tracks, uh, foot footpaths, and we're searching. Understood. Yep. Yeah, great. We found them. Eight two two found them. It's along at the end of the trail. I, I just drove along. Temple, so the the end branch? Yeah, the very end branch there. Copy, yeah, uh, central with patient. Understood. Uh, I just advise if you want me to start rescue that way, they looks like they cleared up their last call. Temple, if we can, uh, they won't be able to get up to this track, but they can get up uh, Ratton Pass and they can wait for us next to the patient's vehicle. Understood. Uh, closest postal 2004, Cassidy. 10 4, but Ratton Pass. Ratton Pass, 10 4. Metro Lima 1. Lima 1, standby. Rescue to 2004, Ratton Pass. Uh, to back up units on scene. Rescue to 2004, Ratton Pass. Backup units for possible transport, 2310. User disconnected from your channel. I'll show you en route at 2310. Lima 1, my apologies, go ahead, sir. We're going to be signal 43 Sierra waiting identifier. Hey, is he responsive? No, he's, do you have a blood sugar tester? 10 4. Yes, he's diabetic, so that'll be one of the first take. things. Alright, yeah, I have a Probably feeling like his blood sugar is going to be way too high from what I'm telling. Because uh, it's usually cool and uh, very wet. Should he be uh, real low? Yeah, he's probably going to be low. Being high wouldn't necessarily cause unconsciousness, but let's have a look here. Um, okay, so can you hear me? It's usually cool and clammy if it's low, so I'm not sure. Sir, can you hear me? All right, let's get some uh, vitals here. Air one counting. Gas. Air, one. Da, da, da. Air one. Are you guys going to stay ten eight? Is Air one? Are you going to go back around? Um, it's quite a long walk uh, from I'll his car. Um, he might just have passed out from heat exhaustion. 
see what's going on with his uh, vitals here. Okay, let's just do a quick survey here, make sure he's got no injuries. Start a uh, 1070 this way at 1034 Marina for a uh, SUV. Okay, so I'm just going to have to cut you, if you can hear me, I'll have to cut your shirt off here. Just need to make sure you've got no injuries that we don't know about. One night's in a cut. Show myself and forward to you and a Okay, third let's get some um, BM done. Hey, sir, sharp scratch here on your finger. Okay, let's see what's going on here. He's uh, slightly hypoxic. Can um, one of you just grab that oxygen bottle out of the bag there? Um, I'm going to right. get a mask on him. Of course. I'll make sure the ambulance is uh, in the right County spot. Perfect. Okay, we are at about... 197. BM's about 8, so that's fine. 10-4. Uh, he's not had a hypo, or a hyper Dispatch episode. He has got high blood pressure, but I don't know what his normal blood pressure is. Okay. Um... We're just going to start moving him, because I can't really explain the unconsciousness at the minute, so, um... Can you grab a board from the brush truck? Um... We... We're going to have to get him out to the ambulance, I don't know how it's going to be best to do that, we might need to use the bed of your truck or something. Alright, I can do that. Um, but if you could grab a board and straps and head blocks off the uh, brush truck, that'd be great. Of course. Appreciate it. Hey, sir, can you hear me? My name's Adam, I'm a paramedic, you're gonna be alright, okay? Dispatch back a channel for Sir, can you hear me? Good. Oh, hello, sir, my name's Adam, I'm a paramedic. Okay. You've, uh,. You've had an accident, but you're going to be all right, okay? What's your name? Uh, uh, Frank? Frank? Nice, nice to meet you, Frank. Like I said, my name's Adam. Got, the, uh, got one of the officers here as well with me. Do you know what's it's happened really, today, Frank? Really, really hot right now. Really hot. Okay. I understand. We're going to get you out to the ambulance and we'll get you some help, alright? Rescue 4 r one Good. Do you know how long until you're going to be here? Yeah. So, have you got any medical history? I... Frank? I right outside the patient's mm -hmm. vehicle. And Wait, diabetic uh, for... I took uh, all my medicine today. You took the correct amount of medicine? Uh, Frank, do you take the correct amount of medicine? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So you're diabetic, you got any heart problems? Surprisingly, no. Sorry? Uh, I said surprisingly, no. No? Okay. So just a diabetes, you don't take any medication for anything else, no? Um, no. Okay, that's I mean, good. Zero five zero from no, that's good, Frank. Don't worry about it. Um, okay, so... What we're going to do is... I don't want you to do any, anything at the moment. I don't want you to try and move, alright? We're going to get you strapped onto this board here. Zero, I'm going to get you out of the ambulance, alright? Okay. Okay. How, you got any pain at the minute, Frank? Uh, 
My head hurts Probably a little. Why I can't turn mm, on the I'm assuming I'll be back I fell. Okay, well, yeah, you might have hit your head as you've gone down. Um, so a little bit of pain in the head. Any pain anywhere else, Frank? No. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. So uh, unconscious on arrival. Um, slightly hypoxic, so I got him on some oxygen. Um, he's diabetic, but his glucose is absolutely fine. Um, presenting as uh, hot. He feels hot. He's got a temperature that I've taken. He's dry to the touch. Um, yeah, sort of unexplained unconsciousness. He's, he's come around, confirmed he's diabetic, no cardiac history. So, um, unexplained episode. Got some pain to the head where he's gone down, but nothing crazy. There's no serious bleeding. His airway's fine, breathing's fine. Circulation seems to be fine. So, I'm just going to get him strapped up to this board. I'm going to get him out of here. Sounds good. Okay, Frank, like I said, we're going to do all the work here, okay? So you just need to just try not to move. Just try and stay nice and calm for me, okay? Okay. All right, so shall we roll towards me, and then you guys can slide under? All right. On three, then. One, two, three. Okay, and down, one, two, three. Perfect. Location, we can try and find him. Frank, I'm gonna put these. Um, uh, somewhere on 68 going west. Actually, hang on a second. I'm over gonna put these straps over your stomach and your chest, alright? It's just gonna keep you attached to the board, so don't worry about it. Okay. Okay. So, Frank, before we move anywhere, I just wanna have a quick check of your neck here, okay? So, you're gonna feel me at the base of your skull and at the, the your upper back, just pressing, okay? I want you to tell me if you feel any pain, any sh uh, sharp feeling, any strange sensation, or if you don't feel anything, okay? Uh, okay. Okay, so starting at the top here. You feel my fingers there? Dispatch back yeah. to me. Okay, so I'm just going to move down, and I just want you to tell me if you feel any pain, any discomfort as we move down, okay? Uh, so we're okay. we going down here, pressing here. You still feel that? I uh, feel it, but no pain. No pain, okay, that's good. We're moving down again. C3... Four, five. Still no pain. Still no pain. Really good, Frank. Six. Okay, nothing at all down there? Uh, no. Okay, perfect, Frank. Negative, sir. It's off. So, um... Am I sweating, or...? I copy. Uh, no, not really. You're, you're, you feel quite dry. I still feel really, really warm. Yeah, you do have a temperature. Definitely. Well, um... Get you out of here. You don't have any recollection of what happened, no, right? Need to get picked up as well. Yeah, we have. I mean, I was just walking, you know, trying to lose a little, little weight. Uh, yeah. The doctor said uh, it's getting dangerous, and I think uh, I might have under overdone it this time. Yeah, you could have got a bit of heat exhaustion. Here, yeah, how long have you been out in the out here lying down? Any idea what time you left? It was still daylight. Still daylight. Oh, okay. So we're gonna get you wrapped up here. And we're gonna get you out, right? County R1, be advised. Um, I okay. Road, I believe. Um, I don't know what the best way to do this is. That's correct. Uh, the brush track doesn't have any room in the back. The best bed's probably gonna be one of the beds. It's a bit too far just to walk with him. Units, just be advised. We did make a Agreed. contact with the truck living station. Okay. Black. Which one's you got the bigger truck? Uh, he was uh, at around nine two. That would be Mr. myself. I've got the F two fifty. Yeah. All right. Do you want to uh, back that up, and we'll man. try and secure him in the bed? Sure. I'll definitely try to. I lost All right. I appreciate. Eyes. He was last in the area of thirteen. I don't know which direction he went. Received. Just gonna be a minute here, Frank. You let me know if you feel any different, okay? Sandy Shore status check. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's get that bed down and see if we can get him on here. Yeah, I got him. Go okay, here, let's get everyone on this, please. For correction, uh, 68. Alrighty, Frank, we're gonna move you to a to a vehicle now, okay? And then we're gonna get you out to the ambulance, all right? Any change in how you're feeling? Any increased pain? No. Still feeling still, warm, right? Still warm. Yeah. Well, I'm not gonna keep you covered up. I'm gonna keep you uh, just your t-shirt on here. It's it's pretty cold out, so um. We're going to hopefully get you cooled down. 
Let me get you into the ambulance so we can give you some call packs, all right? Okay. Okay. Um, right, you guys ready? We'll lift on three. Aye. Okay, uh, I'll get head end if you get feet end and then two at each, uh, one at each side to support. I've got four, twelve, one, nine, seven, yep. one, three, two. We're Lovely. Um, end. so... Bravo one, notice them. We're lifting on three. Bravo one, two, Five, three, uh, lift. Okay, slowly watch one? your feet, guys. Watch for any rocks uh, and it's getting okay, moved towards the vehicle. All right, Frank, you're doing really well. Just uh, Good, bravo, let me know if you feel any different. All right, we're going to go go nice and slow. Uh, truck living, so Supi is a valid license. Okay. Stand by. Any unit near 1034 that can come assist me real quick. 33, I can that way. I'm surprised this has worked so well so far. Although Frank is definitely moving to the edge of the truck. Tad away from the ambulance. Air one, ten, six, cool. Perfect, thank you. You're so much faster than the charge. Totally. I concur. We got it. Oh, there we go. Alrighty, Frank, how we doing? I feel like I might pass out again. Okay. Let's get him uh, onto the stretch. We'll check his uh, vitals again. Get him some uh, fluid. Okay. Hi. Okay, uh, Frank, we're going to lift you up again here, alright? You guys ready? Yep. Okay, one, two, three, lift. lift. Okay, over here. Down on the stretcher. Okay, I'm just gonna check his vitals one more time. Um, see if he can drink as well. Do you mind just uh, getting the ambulance doors open? Getting yeah, that ready. Uh, Appreciate it. All right, Frank, how are we feeling? Maybe a little better. Okay. Let's reduce this oxygen down here. Okay, Frank. Um, do you feel that you can drink at the moment? How do you feel? I uh, I don't. I don't think I can drink anything right now. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I've got some cool packs here. I've got them wrapped in blankets and we're just going to place them uh, 
over you and, and under your legs and uh, you, your back of uh, back of your body, okay? This is just to keep you nice and cool because you've got a high temperature and it looks like you've uh, had a bit of excess, uh, you know, a bit of excess walking in the, in the in the weather and had a bit of a exhaustion slash heat stroke, right? Okay. Alrighty. Let's get you on the ambiolands. lands. Hey Frank, what do you want me to do with your car? You want to leave it here or do you want me to have it taken to town? Uh, you can leave it here. I think my brother's going to come get it. All right, cool. We'll leave it here. He can, uh, yeah. That's good for me. Okay. Are you going to take over rescue from here? Uh, yeah, I can do. Do you want to take the brush back? I can. Uh, yeah, I can do that. Okay, yeah, sounds good. I, I, I mean, you can take the rescue if you want. I don't mind. I'm easy. Stuff. Okay, sounds good. All right, sir. Got you, uh, Sandy Shores Medical Center here, okay? You should be all right. Heat stroke is uh, very treatable, just Go with ahead. some rest and some Except some cooling. So I'm going to hand you over to the nurses here, and um, they're going to monitor you till um, you're back to your, yeah, your, your normal self, and then we can get you discharged, all right? Okay, thank you for all your help. Okay, no worries.